Hi, Zeus here, and I just wanted to share with you that I won my level 20 boss battle just now, and it was against a really good player, Abdurrahman Kuwait, who I assume is from Kuwait in the Middle East, a wonderful country that I've visited. So, Shikran Abdurrahman. So, we're going to show you the combat and then go through the tech tree decisions I made uh, before and after the combat. So here is uh, my battle against uh, Abdurrahman. And I start out, uh, he's got a typical concentrated base with only one cannon on the right side of the gap. And I start with my usual uh, loadout of uh, two heavy choppas and six rocket choppas. A bullet on the far left doing shock knuckles to uh, do some damage and uh, also shock things like cannons that might be taking out uh, rocket choppers that stray. And uh, I threw down some critters there to make sure that the boom cannon didn't snipe my guy. And then I tried to throw a, a flare, uh, I mean, a, a shock rather, into the sky shield, but the first one missed. And as a result, I lost all my critters. So that's a, a mistake, but it, it didn't, uh, didn't prevent me from winning. This is Abdurrahman's attack. He landed everybody on the far right uh, with three heavy choppas and five rocket choppas. After taking out the uh, engine, he flared to the right. One of the, one of the problems with his strategy is that his heavies that are spawning off the heavy choppas are never really in the battle. And you'll see he flares again and the heavies are coming back again. Uh, it has a nice flare. Uh, and then, unfortunately, he gets unlucky, loses one rocket chopper. At this point, losing the heavy chopper is not a problem because they've stopped spawning heavies. But again, notice the whole group of heavies is ne never in the battle. Uh, and that, that does marginally slow you down. It was, it's probably the difference, to be frank. And Abdurrahman also had uh, max barrage, so took down the last engine with that. So I'm feeling very lucky to actually beat a guy like that. So with that victory, I got all the way up on the U.S. leaderboard to number 69. So with the new level 20 chest, uh, let's take a look at the tech tree. I've uh, maxed out pretty much everything at the beginning other than uh, bullet and flare. Thinking about whether or not upgrading bullet makes some sense. It would give you a little bit more uh, offensive firepower. Have not upgraded the mortar all the way. They're pretty low damage. Have not upgraded the gunboat energy all the way. The barrage. Some people are uh, beating me with with uh, barraging out a fourth engine, but I'm so far away from getting the keys to to maxing it out. So I'm debating between uh, those those three things: gunboat energy, barrage, and uh, and bullet. I don't know, it's, it's a close call. You know, if I use the keys and I can't upgrade the barrage, if I hold on to the keys, I can upgrade the barrage. But other people may advance in the meanwhile. It's a tough call. Um, <clears throat> you know, the other issue with upgrading bullet is how long are you going to use bullet? You know, is there, uh, you know, other heroes that you're more likely to open in the future, like brick? Pretty effective once you max her out, you know, because it speeds up your troops. And this is this is all about time and warships. And then Kavan, because you get a uh, a cascade of, of additional troops that just keeps keeps coming and building. You can build up like a wave of troops towards the end of a, of a combat. So it's all good questions. So I think for now I'm just going to hold on to the keys and, and upgrade the barrage. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please subscribe to the channel, give us a like, and thanks as always to Hercules for the video editing. I think it's shock punch, not shock knuckles. No, it's, uh, it's, it's shock knuckles. Oh, um. Yeah, okay. it's shock knuckles.